Well, hello, America. So, the mask mandate in Utah expired a few days ago. And everywhere I've gone, I have still been one of the only people without a mask on. And this is inside, this is outside, this is, I've been all over the damn place since Friday when the mask mandate expired. We're now five days later, or four days later, I guess, four days later. And yet, everywhere I go, people are still wearing their masks. Now, these are the same people, and I know a lot of these people, who have bitched and complained for over a year about masks. And they've stated that as soon as the mask mandate is over, they no longer will wear their masks. And yet, everywhere I go, these people are being hypocritical and still wearing their fucking masks. Now, I made a video about that on my TikTok. And, and since then, I've, I've sat and I've pondered and I've thought, and I've really wondered why people have been so willing to give up their freedoms. And even though now the government's given them permission to have their freedom back, a permission which they never fucking needed in the, in the first place, but now that they have the permission back, they still don't take those masks off. So I started doing research on that. I started looking. I started trying to find out maybe an explanation as to why that happened. And I came across a study that was done in the 60s by the KGB in which they took test subjects and they bombarded them with messages of fear completely filled with lies. And they found that in less than two months, these, brain, these subjects were completely brainwashed. And that no matter amount, no matter how many amount of messages thereafter that they were given that contradicted the original message, that proved the original message wrong, no matter how clearly they were given the actual truth, the people still did not believe the truth and they stuck to the original message of fear that was instilled in them. Because... Fear is one of the most powerful emotions that humans have. And by using fear, governments are uh, able to brainwash people. Now, again, this study was done in the 60s by the KGB that at that time was communist Russia. Now, you can't tell me that 60 years later that our government, that the FBI, that the CIA, the powers that be don't know about these tactics. And if you look around, that is 100% what has been done in our country. People have been so inundated with fear that they are unable to see the truth clearly put before them. Saying.